This is Sarah? This is our grandma? Our grandma? Sarah. Don't you remember? I couldn't save her. I did. Sarah! It's not working. Gungara's trapped her the same way he did me. She's punishing herself because she's convinced she killed Lero. She's put up a strong barrier around herself. We need to do much more to save her. What do I do? How do I save her? She's going to be all right now. I don't sense any pain or fear in her magic energy. That's good, right? <sighs> She's back to herself again. <gasps> Loved you once. And I still love you. You remember? No. My memories are gone. But you... I know you're my husband. I know what we left behind in this house. A journal I kept. I know you are kind. The only man I've ever loved. I've been... I've been waiting for you. That wasn't in Gongora's plans. What was it? Record keeping. Huh? Even though Gongora erased her memory, Sarah was driven back here by the longing in her heart and returned to her home. The home spirit called to her. 
I could live here. The journals she left behind provided a record of her thousand years of living. Nice. Welcome home, Kaim. I remember you. I remember how much I loved you. Part of me knew that I loved someone with all of my heart, even though I had no memory of just who it was. That and... and the feeling that I'd lost someone precious to me. That would be Liram. Liram? Our daughter. Liram is no longer with us. She was... our mother. Our mother was always singing us that lullaby. <laughs> and so, we sang it for you, Grandma. <laughs> I'm Cook. I'm Mac. Nice to meet you. Cook? Mac? My journal kept me living in the past. Now my life is full once again. Because our daughter has given us these beautiful grandchildren. Everything that happens from now on will make new memories to live in my heart. Don't you think that's wonderful? Uh huh. Being surrounded by these mementos is what helped me wait for you. Nice picture. Click. <laughs> oh yeah. What a woman. Mm mm. <laughs> <laughs>